They made over 300 arrests for underage drinking. Uh, we did one weekend out where we arrested over 60, so overall we made 400 arrests. Uh, as you can see on these driver's licenses that were pointed out, uh, the shoddy workmanship when they're put under a blue light, some of the people have duplicate licenses there. Uh, a lot of the help came from the bouncers at Razzles and 509. Uh, they suspected that somebody had phony ID, they would flag down the ABT agents who would then go in and confront a person. And normally when they found out what the penalty would be, they basically said, okay, yeah, you got me my driver's license this morning. Uh, I think the most important thing about this is uh, we really didn't have a lot of violence and chaos. We had big crowds, but we didn't have any violence and chaos. And I think that goes back to what ABT did here. Because if you're taking their licenses away from them early enough in the game, you're preventing them from going out and getting alcohol, which prevents a lot of alcohol fueled violence. So I cannot thank them enough uh, they read the wave quite correctly. You know, Panama City was the hot spot. Everybody knew it was the hot spot, and there was going to be a shift. And that shift came to us. We, we're, we're probably thinking it was probably a 20 or 25 percent increase over the last several years in spring break attendance. But you know, thank the good Lord, we got out of this with uh, very little collateral damage, and a lot of the credit has to fall on ABT for what they did for us. We we want you to come here and have a good time and spend money and then go back home and tell your friends. We're not going to tolerate lawlessness, underage drinking, and, and, be, and destructive behavior. It's just not going to happen. Uh, you know, if you come down here and you behave yourself, you're great. But if you're not old enough to drink, don't drink. Why put yourself and your career, your future, at risk to act like an idiot, you know, stealing a jet ski? I mean, you know, <laughs> uh -huh, it's funny, but it's a felony.